Calculation Options. In the Formulas tab, at the very end, there's a group called Calculation. The very first button in this group is called Calculation Options. Here, we can choose to calculate formulas automatically or manually. Here, we can see that automatic is the default. That means if we make a change to a number, let's say, for example, we change the dollar rate to 1.5, when I press the return key, it automatically goes and calculates any of the formulas that are using that cell. So here I can see the change in the values. So again, if I make a change to the cell, let's say we change it to 1.1, press the return key, and we can see that it recalculates the formulas. If I change the calculation options to manual, it means that when I go in and I make a change to a cell that's being used in a formula, you'll notice that it doesn't automatically recalculate the answer. This can come in very handy when you're making changes to quite a large spreadsheet and you want to wait till the end in order for it to calculate the sheet because there may be a delay while it's calculating large spreadsheets. So you would go and make all of the changes that you want to make, and then at the very end, you will go over to the button here and choose Calculate Sheet. This now means that the active sheet will go and recalculate all of the formulas that have been affected. So by default, it's on automatic, but if you change it to manual, you then need to choose the option Calculate Sheet if you want to update your formulas. Calculate Sheet will only calculate formulas on the active sheet, whereas Calculate Now will go and recalculate all formulas on the entire workbook.